Hi and welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you how you can insert and use footnotes and endnotes in Microsoft Word. But before starting, click on that subscribe button. And now let's go and see how we can insert the footnotes and the endnotes. So, first of all, in order to insert a footnote or an endnote, I need to go onto the references tab. And from here you can see this section for the footnotes. From here I can insert a footnote. First of all I will place the cursor after the solar system words here for example. So I'll press on insert footnote. And as you can see it automatically took me to the end of the page. And it started with number one which means the first footnote. And here... I can write anything like, for example, the solar system contains the following planets. And for example, I can write the planets after it. Then if I want to insert another footnote, I can, for example, here in the 4.6 billion years ago, and insert footnote and it will start with number two and let's say for example this number is calculated by x theory and let's say that now i want to insert a third footnote i can insert it here and i can say for example the smaller objects are but what happens if I remove one of the footnotes for example let's say that I remove footnote number two automatically the footnotes next to it will start counting in consecutive order so uh, this one that was numbered as three now it's number two and it replaced the footnote that was removed also if I want to insert an endnote, so for example, for this picture, I can select it and press on insert endnote. And here, the endnotes will, will be numbered in Roman numbers. So I can see Roman number 1. And I can say, for example, this picture is illustrated by... And as you can see, the endnote appears in the last page of my document. Now, let me show you, for example, if I want to go from one footnote to another. Let's say that I'm in footnote number one. If I press on next footnote, I will go into the footnote number two. And you can see the cursor is here. If I press next, I will not go anywhere else because this is the last footnote. And if I press here, I can see that I can also go to previous endnote. And I can go into next end note. And as you can see here, it took me to the end note for this picture, which is Roman number one. Also, I can change some settings for the footnotes. If I press on this arrow to expand the footnotes section, you can see, for example, for footnotes, I can choose to put them in the bottom of page or below text. For end notes, I can choose put them in end of document or end of section. I can also do something else. I can convert an end note into a footnote. We will test it later. Also I can change the numbering for an end note. For example now it's in Roman numbers but let's say that I want to have it in ABC order. I can also add custom marks here for example a symbol for the end notes, for example, this arrow, and numbering it can be continuous or restart for each section. And I can apply changes to whole document, or if I have sections, I can apply to section by section. Let's press apply and see what happens. You can see now the end note is in alphabetic ordering, and it starts with the A. And now let's test if we want to change the endnotes into footnotes. So if I press on convert, 
and I can, from here I can convert all footnotes to endnotes, convert all endnotes to footnotes, or swap footnotes and endnotes. So let's convert the endnotes to footnotes and see what happens. I'll press OK, and if I close the window now, it automatically made this picture as footnote number two, and this moved to the next number, which is number three, and you can see the endnote that was this picture is illustrated by is now a footnote and not an endnote. Also, last thing to show is if I go into print view, you can see how the footnote appears when you print out the document. Also, for the end notes, it's the same. It appears in the end of the last picture. I hope this video was helpful for you to let you know how to use the end notes and footnotes. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and to like and share this video.